Hi everybody, this is Solomon Schmidt from HistoryBites.com. Today we're going to talk about Thomas Aquinas. Thomas Aquinas was born around 1225 in present-day Italy. As a young boy, he was trained to become a monk in the Roman Catholic Church. In 1239, he began attending the University of Naples in Italy, and five years later, Thomas became a Roman Catholic Dominican friar. A friar is similar to a monk, except that friars live and work among common people, while monks live a solitary life with other monks, separated from the outside world. In 1245, Thomas went to the Faculty of the Arts at the University of Paris and learned about theology, which is the study of God. While there, he most likely met Albertus Magnus, who was also a Dominican friar. In 1248, Albertus went to teach at a Studium Generale, a medieval university in Cologne, Germany. Thomas followed him there, and in 1250, he was ordained as a priest. While in Cologne, Thomas taught about the Old Testament, and in 1252, he returned to the University of Paris, where he earned his master's degree in theology. After completing his degree, Mr. Aquinas taught theology in Anani and Orvieto, which are two cities in Italy. In 1268, he returned to Paris and continued teaching. Throughout his career as a teacher, Mr. Aquinas published many different books on the Bible and theology. His most famous work is called Summa Theologica, and a complete five-volume English translation of it was first published in 1911. Mr. Aquinas was a very important figure in the Christian church. He believed that the purpose of the whole universe is to fulfill God's plan of salvation for sinners through his son, Jesus Christ. He used reason and logic to defend the Christian faith. Thomas Aquinas died in 1274 in present-day Italy. He was one of the most famous and influential theologians of all time. The Roman Catholic Church canonized him in 1323. Comment below and tell me if you know how many pages the 1911 English translation of Summa Theologica is. Please give this video a thumbs up, click that subscribe button, and ring the notification bell to stay up to date with all of my videos. And until next time, go learn your history.